University. Uh, we are campus ambassador of Applied University Wikipedia Education Program. So in this presentation, we will be giving you just a, a brief introduction of how Wikipedia Education Program works in Applied University. So this is the outline of the program. First, we will go through uh, what is Applied University Wikipedia Education Program. Present. Uh, this, uh, they will contribute to Wikipedia one or the other way. This is usually my. Uh, this is, this is usually meant for undergraduate students who are studying uh, languages Tamil, Hindi, Kannada and Sanskrit. And yeah, also, Christ University uh, uh, released first of its kind Wikipedia uh, video tutorials which are available on commerce and YouTube as well. So in this photo you can see the person in black suit is Ayat Joseph Kringlo. He is the register of Christ University. Actually, uh, he only took the initiative to start uh, Christ University, uh, the, this Wikipedia education program at Christ University. The person uh, in uh, right is Pavel Ajah sir, he's sitting over here. He, uh, he helped us uh, too much uh, while carrying out this, this program. The other person is Mr. Tamir, he is working at CIS. And we tell all of this, and it's very much available here. Yeah. Thank you. So, what is the role of community in Christ University Wikipedia education program? So the dedicated community members, uh, they only take the initiative and they help us to run this program at Christ University. We have many community members who visited our uh, university to help the students regarding their assignments. Uh, their guidance was very much valuable for us. We had Ravi Shankar and Sundar from the uh, Tamil community. We had Sayan and uh, uh, Ms. Shubha from Sanskrit community. Uh, they came to Christ University, they organized workshops, they guided us uh, with how to carry out these programs, they suggested us what assignments we can give to students so that in maximum possible way we can, uh, we can uh, like, uh, contribute to Wikipedia. Community members also help to provide us feedback on the assignments which are given, means how the students are uh, doing those assignments, are they vandalizing Wikipedia, uh, what mistakes they are making. The other thing is, uh, Community members also help us in keeping a check on uh, the work done under the Christ University Wiki Wikipedia Education Program. We, we are getting many suggestions how we can improve this program since 2013. This program was started in 2013 in Christ University and since then we are getting uh, enormous support from community, various communities. Now, how Christ University wants to implement Wikipedia Education Program. So, before commencement of every academic year, there is an official meeting uh, between CIS people and, depart, uh, and uh, members of Department of Languages at Christ University. They decide what kind of assignments can be given to students for what duration. And uh, yeah, assignments are planned in such a way that uh, students will gradually learn the process of editing on Wikipedia, the basic ethics of editing on Wikipedia through a uh, through course of four semesters. The process starts with uh, creating a user account. That is the basic, uh, basic thing which everyone should possess. And yeah, uh, in the beginning, the first semester itself, students will come to know the uh, basic Wikipedia pillars, policies and rules, especially the NPOV thing. Uh, then uh, students will practice uh, how to type in their respective languages. Since we all know how to type in uh, English, we are very much familiar with it. But typing in Sanskrit, Tamil, Kannada or Hindi is quite too difficult for them. So the first semester is completely dedicated to like practicing with typing and knowing the basic uh, uh, basic rules and policies of Wikipedia. Then, uh, then in next semester, they will come to know how to add images, references, internal wiki links to the pages. So uh, once they are well versed with uh, practicing uh, like uh, typing Wikipedia, also adding images, references. They can go on with writing their own articles. So in third and fourth semester, I dedicated for this thing. So uh, uh, now comes the evaluation part. How we evaluate these articles? Like based on the quality of articles, language proficiency, and other Wikipedia parameters. Uh, like uh, are they following the policies uh, uh, and rules of Wikipedia and all these things? By keeping all these things in mind, the evaluation is done. Now the faculty support at Christ University. These are the members of the Department of Languages at Christ University. Sebastian sir and George Joseph are from uh, Hindi department. Krishna uh, Swami sir and Jati ma'am are from Kannada department and Narayana ma'am is from the uh, Sanskrit department. So we are getting enormous support from these uh, uh, our faculty members. Yeah. So Shabama will uh, uh, speak for the topics. Good morning 
everyone. So we spoke about how we work at Christ University and this is the academic activities which he already spoke about so I'm not going to take that time. Okay, we come to the achievements and contributions. Understanding we know what we are doing and the impact of work we have, there's no point in running any program anywhere in the world. So the achievements is like type, we have typed and digitized books in different languages in Sanskrit. The first two are for Sanskrit, second one is for Kabir Gantavali is for Hindi and the next uh, three are for uh, from Kannada department and Tamil encyclopedia is from Tamil. What we basically do, it's like uh, when you uh, come across students and various questions at Christ University that why do we need this program as a part of our curriculum. The basic problem which we face is that people come to our uh, they are, they have to do it because it's a part of their, you know, assessment and they are evaluated for that and they have to get marks. But at the end, it's our responsibility and especially the community members who come to give us those, you know, feedbacks and we have to encourage them. The whole point of Christ University Wikipedia Education Program is to involve students not just for the sake of marks but for the interest. And that's how we have to create like by giving different assignments. When, we, when I personally joined Christ University, I had no idea what Wikipedia is. But then there was something which attracted me. I'll talk about that. And that goes for this workshop. We had a Wikipedia and education workshop, uh, national review workshop in Christ University in the month of March this year. And oh, there, yeah, I was also one of the students who were forced to be a part of it. But later when you go and then you see that how big such a big platform, you get to be a part of it and then you, then you realize the importance of you know being a part of such a big thing. So in this workshop, the, uh, the Christ University with other partners of CIS from different places like Pune, Andhra Pradesh, Vijayawada came together to discuss the problems faced in running WEP. We conducted different activities like presentations, lightning talks and group activities in order to find solutions. So what we actually did was we, uh, we invited colleges from around Bangalore and places like Andhra Pradesh, Pune and some colleges are uh, St. Agnes, Agnes College from Bangalore, St. Aloysius College Bangalore from Maharashtra, we had Andhra Loyola College from Vijayawada and one of the women's college from Pune. So what we did, we started with our workshop uh, by a group activity, we, we, we gave them charts and we told them if you have to, you know, uh, rather advertise Wikipedia and explain your concept in a chart, how would you do that? And we divided community members and the participants from different languages. So unfortunately you become familiar with different languages and you try to collaborate. There's no point in having a successful program. So the major impact of this workshop was that many areas which were overlooked in WEP were discussed and people came up with interesting solutions. The major outcomes I would like to state that after this we had some uh, uh, like students who were already doing a part just for the CIA they became the regular editors on Wikipedia and I am one of them. And I would also like to focus on one part like many students or you know many faculty they don't have uh, access to internet since they come from different backgrounds and uh, different places where uh, internet is not available all the time. So at Christ University, we have our computer labs, which is open from 8 to 8, 12 hours, where they can go, edit, do anything. And in case if you want to work after 9, then we have a library. We have two libraries, and the main library is open from 7 to 9. And we have computer systems there too. And I'd like to add about uh, things like the, ba uh, the basic challenges which we face like uh, while running WET. The biggest challenge is managing and assigning the work to 1500 and plus students. The population is quite big at our university. So you know, going to getting each and every detail and each and every contact meeting of every student and mailing them their work is a very big job. Second is uh, faculty teachers they are not comfortable with using new technology. So we have at times we need to train and we need to have sessions for the faculty as well that they can also learn the art of using technology and using digital media as a tool for our holistic education. We have complaints from uh, students regarding deletion of their articles and even user pages. And uh, this, I would like uh, you know, to request the committee members, whoever are present there, that instead of deleting the articles, like the whole articles which they 
you know, put hours together, just give them a warning mail or you know, just try to tell them what mistakes they are doing. Instead of just deleting their article because at the end they are evaluated for it and they are marked on it. And at times the quality of articles at times are not up to the mark. This is why I am saying this because See, you have a full bucket of apple, but every apple will not be as fresh, you know, as you pick it from the tree or the garden. So that's why I say, and the point is, many students face a program of, you know, a problem of typing. So what we tell them, that whoever is well versed with typing, you can give us our articles. Uh, we also ran an editathon in the month of March regarding Wiki Women's Week, where it was a one-day editathon where we almost, um, uh, you know, contribute. Uh, some 29 members came up with six to seven hundred articles. But after that, you see the ratio falling down. It was just for a day. So we need to find ways. And I would request if anybody has better ways, you know, to tell us how we can make these users a regular users and regular editors on Wikipedia, because that matters at the end. One day, one person is coming up, creating an account, and then he is absent for the whole year, and is active only when the uh, assignments are given, that's not fair. It's not justification of the Wikipedia education program. So I uh, also will, uh, I request the committee members to respond when we have uh, put up things on the village page, especially for Hindi Wikipedia, since I'm representing Hindi Wikipedia, I face this problem a lot. Okay, uh, any questions? That's all is about our program. I'll just speak loudly. Uh, how much of the work is based on translation versus original writing and research? Okay, so we uh, basically tell them, encourage them to produce their own, you know, own, own articles because when you come to translation, there's another piece of work. Okay. It's an extra work that students have to do. They have to be well versed with the way they translate the meaning, and translation at times is difficult for us. Because uh, when you uh, translate things from English Wikipedia, we tell them get the content out of that and you can write it in the own words, not just exactly translate it. And you also avoid the usage of Google Translate because then there are a lot of grammar mistakes and everything. Okay, I have something to ask all as well as coming up. So, you mentioned about the articles being deleted. But uh, we have strictly instructed that student first should write only in the sandbox. Yes. Sir. After it is approved only, it has to be made live. So after approved and then made on live, also they have been deleted. Yeah, they are deleted and the user pages are also deleted. No, how is that? Even we were shocked so, about that. So uh, who is uh, who approved that in that case? Who approved who approved your articles from sandbox to make it live? No, uh, the approval, we were... the approval is supposed to be given either by faculty or by. Our uh, CS staff or yes. some community member, yes. there's some set of people to approve. No, well, this is what happened in the last year when third semester students were working with uh, uh, their articles on culture and language. They had this, uh, they, their sandbox, they were approved, the articles were approved. By but later, no, no, my question uh, is, by okay. Okay. Yes, then, not, then, not yeah, then also the articles were approved without giving any warning ways. I think this problem we are facing maximum in Sanskrit. Uh, there are many students uh, whose user pages are deleted. Means uh, uh, just like, uh, the admins are, are telling that if you are on Sanskrit Wikipedia, then your user page must be in Sanskrit. Means you can't use English or other language. Means uh, it is your user page. You can use uh, any language uh, you want. Uh, but so the user page is for user page. page you wrote in Sanskrit Wikipedia in English. Uh, no, means uh, a part of it was in English. Okay, your user page in Sanskrit Wikipedia. Wikipedia. Actually, had English content and it was deleted. Yeah. Not so. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll start. Uh, good morning, uh, future Wikipedians. Uh, I am envy of you. When you guys met, I was like you. I was nothing. You are something here now. But congratulations for that. Happy actually. That in which you are meeting. And I appreciate the way you have presented. That's also there. Uh, use this thing. I request you to just move to the slides. Uh, Two things are there. Uh, little back, little back, little back, little back. Wait, 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 wait. wait. No, no. After that, the, the process you are evaluating the students. Uh, here, here, let me, here actually there is a suggestion. Yeah. You see, if you are not there, I am unable to understand who this person is. Name is there, designation is there, but the language, that is the main thing, it is not there. 
please start with the right first thing. Okay. Please go back a little bit. Slides. Yeah, one more. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Now uh, you are forced to tell that Anil Joseph Beto was a minister. You just add inside that as sitting at the center. Okay, it will be clever because if you want to upload it, nobody knows that one. You see, if I am a graduate, definitely I am going to give any uh, this thing for me. Why? Because the basic for everything you have done, you have, you have, you have, you have prepared excellent vegetable or non vegetable biryani, except that, that, that uh, salt is missing. It's like that. So please, two slides, sir. Two slides. One more. One more. You have followed or backward? You please go forward. Now okay. both slides follow. One more. One more. One more. Here, here, here. The last line. Actually, I wanted to ask this question, but all this have already just responded that one. That is responded. You see, based on the quality of articles, language proficiency, and other parameters, evaluation is done. I was afraid that uh, how evaluation is being done if, uh, if, if an article is going live. Well, because others can also jack, they make it the best article possible. So it should be there in the sandbox itself. Yes. Okay, that's the very answer. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. To, uh, uh, shall I answer that? Actually, we, had a, we have made a spreadsheet. Yes, sir. There is a call of for topic selection, mark for topic selection, mm -hmm. then mark for language. Then mark for uh, links, then mark for references, then mark for images, tables, all category, uh, like that. I can show you the question okay. if you want. And this is done when it is in the sandbox. Yes. Good. And also, in any, like, sir, if you want, we can say, we'll give you the report of the whole year, 2015 and 16 more. I have a copy of that, but it would be great if you shared your slides on Wiki later. Okay, okay, sure. Yeah. Any other yeah. questions? The question is how many are the retention? <laughs> how many are still Wikipedia? <laughs> so, thank you.